Let's see, in this episode? Well, I think it's time to take on our main quest. Um, we are going to take on a Professor Shark's assignment. And also the, uh, this one. Let's take on this one first. Because this one's, it's like straight to hog's meat. Um, and then we'll take on the, uh, the map chamber. Plus, you can also get some gold for this. Because as you can see, gold, we can get some gold for it. Uh, let's see, so, find the one-inch statue. So that's gonna be all the way in Hogwarts. So, let's find the, uh, supply controller. Let's find the supply controller back to... Then the, uh, I need the dual sense edge controller with it has the trigger stops. I control the, uh, the medium trigger stop. Which probably allows you to, uh, know. It's good for certain games, just not this game, though. I don't, I don't know the whole trigger action on this game. Go ahead and land here. <clears throat> yeah, here's one of the keys. Down there. Or is it like right around? It's right around this area, but the uh, flu flame is right there. I'm just gonna go down here and grab this. There you go, grand staircase. Okay, it's actually leading us this way. Okay, so it's actually leading us up this way. Okay. That's fine. Totally fine. So, yep, there's a field guide. This looks like the right statue. Uh, okay, it's right here. Password. Now, if I remember correctly, there's also another quest we could do, like right here, but only at night. And the one thing is, I do want to do that, but not right now. Actually, I think I can actually do this. Hang on, I'm gonna just switch this to night quickly. Okay, the guy's not here, but I know there's a side quest you can do here at night. It's actually no of our main quest, and so this is back to daytime. Guy's not here. That's really useful, especially at day and night, day, uh, night to day. It's easy. But here we go. Descendium. Goodness, who knew this was all down here? A lift must be how I get down. Looks broken though. Oh, that was, that was, that was, that was, that was, that was my, that was my mistake. Who knew this was all down there? Alright, it's one secret passage, we can do this. A lift must be how I get down. Looks broken though. Broken, eh? Well, uh, oops, no, not into that. Um, spells. Uh... I think her power will work. Huh. 
That seems to have done the trick. Protego! As it is named. This castle will never cease to surprise me. Alrighty. <clears throat> we are in the secret passage. Okay, we do need a um incendio. Oh, do you have a gun in no, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm trapped. How am I supposed to get out of here? If I could lift this platform, I think I could get it to work. I keep getting the buttons mixed up, dude. Going to have to get past this. Come on, dude. Really? That seems broken. Let's uh, just uh, repair that. And now there we go, so... There's an uh, head to our main quest. This must be the way. I need to find a way to open that gate. Incendio. Something smells sweet. Must be close to honey. Ah, honey jukes. I can smell the chocolate. Now. Where would I find the dried billywig stings for Gareth? I have the dried billywig stings. Now back to Gareth. I can only imagine how his new recipe is going to turn out.
<laughs> I cannot imagine like what this uh, this uh, shop would have to smell like. Now I can hog mid. <clears throat> and uh, let me just go ahead and take a look at our gear. Nah. <laughs> I have a nice uh, green scarf now. I'm selling this for a good price. You have a sharp eye for fashion. Be sure to stop by whenever you're about. Yeah, once we uh, have like more clothes and clothing items and whatnot, I'll we'll definitely be able to make sure that we actually uh, sell them. Because we can get a high price for them. Is there like a, a teleport? I hope I take a fast travel. Close to Gareth. Uh, Great Hall would be closest, I guess. How nice to see you, my young friend. Hello, Gareth. I have those dried billywigs things. You got them? Incredible. Getting them was more work than I expected. I'd like to be paid for my time. Of course. Didn't think it would be that much trouble, but I'm happy to pay for your help. Thank you again. I'll let you know when I brewed my first batch of fizzing whiz beer. All right. <laughs> That is it. 300? Nice, I'll take it. Alright, now we can actually gun it for the, uh, the map chamber. So there's another side quest over yonder, over this way, like right to this room, like right over yonder. I could do that in the left chamber. Because I see another side quest. I have a yonder. Okay, where is this main quest? It's right here. Let's see. 
Uh, yeah, Charon's class. Okay, so we're going to talk to Professor Fig first. We can't just go to the afternoon, that's a, that's a later, that's a later quest. That's a later quest. Okay, also says the second that we gotta do that way. I was hoping to see you. You're back. Finally. Minister Spavin talks more than he listens. Ranted on and on about rogue dragons. Wouldn't listen to a word about goblins. Speaking of which Listen, Professor. So much happened while you were away. I received a flurry of messages from Professor Black's house elf, Scrope. Scrope sent you messages? Yes. I thought it was odd, too. He asked me to meet him and then told me to take the toast. Why would you want to take toast? To a cave under the lake. That's where I found Richard Jackdaw's ghost. Who on earth is Richard Jackdaw? He was a student here long ago. Anyway, he told me about a secret cavern. I went there, and right next to Jackdaw's skeleton, I found the missing pages. You found the pages? I did. And because Jackdaw had followed the map they contained, when I found the pages, I found the location on the map. Believe it or not, it's a room below Hogwarts. Why am I not surprised? Shall we? I was hoping you'd say that. Oh, and we'll need to bring the book. The room is called the Map Chamber, by the way. And the portrait of Percival Rackham awaits us there. Professor Rackham? I look forward to meeting him. How did this Jackdaw get the pages from the book? Evidently, Peeves stole them, and Jackdaw stole them from him. Oh, Peeves. To think it was beneath us all this time. If only you were here to see this. Hello, Professor Rackham. We've placed the book on the pedestal as you asked. And this is my mentor, Professor Fig. How do you do, Professor Fig? And you, my young friend, see now why you needed to return with the book? I do. I also see why you refer to this room as the map chamber. That you have come this far tells me that you possess extraordinary magical ability, the potential and power of which will unlock should you prove yourself worthy. The location of each of four trials will, in time, appear on the map. Trials that will test you and give you access to invaluable knowledge. Trials that you must complete on your own. 
Do you recall the pensive memory you viewed in my vaulting Gringotts? You and your friend Charles spoke of the port key, and of trials you'd created for one who could see traces of ancient magic. Precisely. Charles is another of the keepers, a designation we gave ourselves centuries ago, in light of the knowledge that we have been bound to keep hidden. Until, perhaps, now. So, the passage from your ruins to Gringotts, everything in the vault, the restricted section, finding this room, none of these was a trial. They were an important part of the journey, but they were not trials themselves. The fact that you have come this far, however, bodes well. The trials were designed to ensure that the power and knowledge we have kept secret for so long does not fall into the wrong hands. They will test your abilities, both innate and learned. But of equal importance, everything you witness as you complete the trials will inform what you choose to do with all that we share. You will need patience. The trials have much to teach you. It will take time. I'm afraid we don't have the luxury of time. We have waited this long, Professor Fig. Surely a few more. Respectfully, sir, while I do not know the secret you keep, I do know that our young friend here has seen traces. Traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. And we encountered an uncommonly powerful goblin wielding such magic as we prepared to leave your vault at Gringotts. We may already be too late. This is grave news indeed. Young friend, do you trust Professor Fig? I do. Then, in the light of your considerable skill and all you have already accomplished, we shall begin. You will find the location of the first trial marked on the map below you. Whilst Professor Fig may assist you in locating the trials, they may be completed only by one with our ability. Shall we have a look? I know that tower. It's not far. You may have seen it yourself. I don't think I have. Perhaps your young friend is not as well-traveled as you think. As your mentor, the least I can do is go ahead to make sure it is safe. Join me as soon as you can. You said that you know that tower. What can you tell me about it? Not much, I'm afraid. I've passed it dozens of times. It's north of Hogsmeade. My recollection is that it seems abandoned. Clearly, however, the tower conceals more than meets the eye. I'll find you at the tower as soon as I can. Until then, be careful. And do not tell anyone where you're going. Bathroom and complete. I think we are almost like close to the uh the best part of this game where we can start to learn the uh the spells are it's time you learned Iglesias, the freezing spell. It is an efficient way to cool down a heated situation. But first, I will need you to complete a few tasks. Once you've done that, come and see me. Uh, <laughs> Good on Glacius, that's another one we need to learn, dude. Um, yeah, we are gonna learn those, um, abilities. Um, soon enough, I just want to take care of... Let's see what they are, though. Like, what do we need to do? Like, um, Papaloons? Over Hogsmeade Station, and then pop up. Okay, yeah, that's easy. That's easy. That's that makes it like easy. It's just, like easy in this episode. We could do that. Yeah, so that one's not too hard. That one's pr pretty easy. We just need to fly. That one we need to, we need to fly. Nope. 
Like that. Alright, so what I want to do is we're going to pop the balloons over the Quidditch pitch. Because, well, look, there are balloons over here. Revelio. Yep, so there's one of them. That. One there. One there. One there. One there, and there should be one more around here. The Galadon? Yeah, I'm missing one of them. Okay, Revelio. If you don't know where something is, it's cast Revelio and you'll find it. There it is. And there you go, that's the last one. There you go, go to town point. Now I intend to find, now I intend to pop the balloons over the Hogwarts uh, station. So I'm gonna go ahead and trap this one. Because it is right there. It only goes right to there. I'm not going to do the main quest, I'm actually going to do the side quest right now, which is actually pretty easy to do. Because I'll say this one is a lot easier than doing the, uh, the flick Swede, uh, one, which we will do. We will do that one, eventually. I guess most of these spells, uh, take time learning. But yeah, this one's a freezing spell. Glacius. Rebellion. Uh, cast Rebellio here. Yep, so here's the balloons. One. Two. Three. Velio. Uh, let's see. Oh. Four. Revelio. One time. Velio. Where's the last one? Revelio. Dude, I'm like missing one balloon. Revelio. God, where is it? So I did this the first time, it's easy. What's the last goddamn balloon? Revelio. No, I swear I won't be wasting. I swear it should be around here somewhere. Rebellion. Revelio. I keep casting the value because, uh. What do I want with the Nifla? He's sharp. Stole from me, he did. Because it's sitting around here. And not. Oh, there it is. Finally. Found it. Freeze. There you go. There you go.
and turns into Gala and Shield, which is just Glacius. Which is another spell I want to have in my arsenal. Tasks. Madam Kagawa, I completed the list of tasks you assigned. Wonderful. I trust you became more familiar with your broom through the process? Yes, Professor. That's good to hear. Keep it up, and perhaps one day you'll have a spot on the Quidditch team. If Black ever permits Quidditch again. <laughs> well, with those tasks out of the way, let us get started. Glacius. <clears throat> Pay attention to your wand work. Yeah. Well done. I'd recommend that you practice your new spell here in my office before taking it out into the world. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to cross this place to the sewer. That's blocked. That is like every single spell we learn. There you go. Catching on quickly. That. I think it's learned its lesson, but do continue to practice as long as you like. Kinesthesia is a powerful learning tool. Alright. We're good. Uh, let's see, how much hand coins we have? 461. Uh, no, let's go Hogmead. Hogmead. Go to the magic map. Fast over here. I think we should have enough. I'm told that last Clementine had you. Welcome. Come on in. Now, where was I? Right. Oh, yes. <laughs> now, you let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. No one can say I don't uh. keep a stack shelf. Okay, folks, please. So what we're going to do is we're going to go back to Hogwarts and go to the Room of Requirements. Deke hasn't seen this many plants here before. Nothing to identify, for now at least. Deke thinks you should be proud of all the potions you've brewed. In cross pot size, great. Fantastic. Okay, so we need to grab more uh, things from Tom and Scrolls. Back to Hardmaid. That's a hard maid. Uh, not all vendors, we need a... Uh... Yeah, Tome Skulls. That's all this one. I want to make sure that I actually grab... 
I need a need. Can send us stuff now that we need. Is that for it? We need a lot of stuff. Hello there. Come on in. Plenty to look at here. I'm going to sell. A pleasure doing business with you. Another a thousand to one that. Jesus Christ, you know dude. Anything else I can do to help. Well, we're gonna get more money anyway, so. Anyways, we'll go to that. Uh, we'll, go, we'll do our main quest. Why not? I'll turn out to for uh, broadcasting. 36 minutes? Yeah. Um. Let's go ahead and do the main quest. Which is over here. And I can't fly while one of hogs man, so I ah, uh, we need to uh walk our way out of hogs and then we can actually fly. I wish I had a room that could fly. Making it on, getting around a whole lot easier. <sighs> man, I think, I think traveling to these conferences is a whole lot easier, man. Ashton doesn't make getting around so much easier as well. Oh. Got that. Fly now? No. I can fly. Well, one second pop. Play optional. Enemies, I'm not gonna focus, I'm not gonna bother with them right now. We can uh, focus on those guys later. Damn, dude, I didn't think it was room upgraded. Gain Sebastian's trust. Alright, here we go. A resto momentum, the slowing charm. It allows you to freeze objects or people in midair. Simply complete a few tasks and then come and see me. <laughs> Madam Kangawa, really? Another task? Practice flying near uh, sprites. Practice flying near uh, game winch. Fun. <laughs> like, seriously, the second we get done with Glacius, he wants to teach us another curse. We're not alone. We are not. Ranrock's loyalists. Around a dozen, I can see, but could be more. Can't we operate past them into the tower? We could. 
but we've no idea what's in the tower. More importantly, however, I'd like to know why they're here. They've set up camp just ahead. I suggest we investigate a little before doing anything else. Let's go. Well, this isn't ideal. No, it isn't. This way. And I'd suggest we use the disillusionment charm here. No sense in announcing our arrival. Bring me a dozen humans to battle. I'll take them all. Run the other way when they see me, humans do. Every time. Quickly now. Stay hidden and cast Petrificus Totalus. Petrificus Totalus. Well done. Seriously, just freeze them. Get some more money. Oh, they can one flush in, which we really don't need. from Ranrock. These orders indicate that they're after something to do with names. What names? And why here? I will draw blood. This is why I just shot him to defend.
like we found the entrance. It's locked. An unlocking charm. Very handy. No time now, but if you don't learn it soon enough, we can work on it back at the castle. I like that. I totally like that. A little more. Uh... Welcome to San Bacar's Tower. Hello, Professor. Did you say Sam Bacar's tower? I did. Professor Bacar is a keeper you have yet to encounter. I'm glad to see that I was correct in presuming that we would meet again soon after our last encounter. Though I surmise, based on the commotion I heard, that you did not have an easy time getting to me. We did not, Professor. We encountered goblins outside the tower. That goblins were aware of my vault is disquieting enough. But if they have also made a connection to this tower, then the threat may be greater than I thought. All the more reason for us to move forward. Downstairs, near the entry, a reservoir of ancient magic, like those you've seen before, has been unlocked. Commanded to access a doorway. I'm afraid I cannot say more. As Professor Fig cannot join you, he and I will, in time, see you back at the map chamber. Remember what you see. We're going to need to understand how Ranrock's loyalists knew about a tower that once belonged to a keeper. For the moment, however, you've more important things to set your mind to. A reservoir of ancient magic, I believe? Yes, sir. Then I shall leave matters in your increasingly capable hands. That said, be careful. I will, sir. I'll see you back in the map chamber. A reservoir of ancient magic, downstairs, near the entry. There you go, the first trial. I've right, seen this before, in Gringotts and the Restricted section. <laughs> Alright guys, these trials are no joke. Sometimes these can be extremely hard. Like here, here's our first puzzle. That's gonna be a thing is, it's gonna take the stairs down here. There you go. That must have done something. Best have a look around. Yeah, as you guys can see, we can see a bridge. Right here, we can see an, it's an invisible bridge. But once we pass through this portal, boom. Now we're in a different dimension. Put into the bridge. So we got that. Grab what you can here. A lot of times it's going to be useful later. And um, let's see here. Alright, now this part. Jesus Christ, is it annoying. This is the second trial. All traces of ancient magic. Something must be different. Alright, this is the second trial, well, the second piece of the first trial, so, so, one, two. So, honestly, I'm going to pass it the phone and I'll say something very different. Yep, right here. Incentive! You can see there's something different here. And we pass through here. 
Normalize, and we are here. Welcome sight. At least I know what to expect this time. These look familiar. Thank you. Yeah, so as you can see, most of the portal are in the area. And if you pass here, we're back in the same dimension. So what I want to do is run past this way, past the portal, and continue no forward. Statues. So we got more statues. So, you guys should uh, fight by now. I don't follow this video, I guess. Now I do, hold on. I'm gonna uh, Defendo. Defendo. Oh, something to disarm them. I can, like, I can sort of run back at them. Yeah, this is here. Yeah, now this trial, I remember the hard one. So what you want to do is pass through here, and as I can see, 
Now we want to get to this side over here. So, what we want to do is... Seems I ought to explore this archway from both sides. Accio. It's to Accio this. This way. But for this... Uh, for, uh, position it such as the way yeah, so as you can see now I can actually access this archway from over here thank you there you go so Honestly, basically just move the uh, thing to the other side and then pass it the full and Accio your way over here. Now see my next challenge is you know, get over there somehow. Not sure how, but virtually I can figure a way out. But I can. I'll never get used to these floors. Alright, I'm pretty sure yeah, we got a battle, I'm pretty sure. Yep. There we go. Right back at him. Okay, these guys here too. Because of me. Boom. Off of the head. Alrighty. Yeah, I'm pretty much done here. Oh, of course. Another trial. <laughs> Dude, I hate this. These trials I really do hate. Yeah, here's the next annoying one that we gotta do. Pass through here. Yeah, so as you can see, we need to position ourselves such as a way that we can get over here. Now 
to see what's changed on each side of this archway. In the trial, and now finally complete. We're done with this trial. But as you can tell, yeah, I'm not. Got a reward. Some Lego Mill potions, which we really don't need. But you guys know that it's not gonna be that easy. Yeah, we're gonna battle. One, oh, can't. <laughs> off the end. The end. Done. Earn this guy. Take out the window and put on Nice Oyamas. I can bring go. This guy's not that hard. I think what we need to do is actually cast... Glacius on that. Yeah. Past, uh, one of the yellow curses. Yep. Just wail on him. Yep, now he's going buff again. Dodge. Well on him. Dodge. Well on him. 
Dodge whale. Dodge whale on him. Dodge whale on him. Do not do as possible. Got the instant magic. Do the same thing. Well on the horse as possible. Well on them. Once as possible. Got the instant magic. Dodge, well, um, fuck that. Accio. Dodge. Magic, turns this guy off, getting down. And we buff him again. No, we're done. What a relief. Yeah, you just said it, what a relief. Oh my god, that was a long one. But now I get... Uh, now I get a memory. There we go. Alright, I'm gonna stick right here so we can actually get... So you guys can actually enjoy this cutscene. I'll see you guys after the cutscene. Your ability to transfigure the world around you is remarkable. What is it? My father isn't getting better. I don't think he'll ever recover from the death of my brother. It is agonizing to see those we love suffer. The trout was years ago. But the pain of losing him is as deep for him now as if it had happened only yesterday. He doesn't need pretty pillars, he needs peace. What if I could help him, Professor? You do so much for your father already. It's not enough. I want to take away his pain. It is tempting, I know to use this magic that you're mastering to transfigure more than the physical world. But human emotion is a potent force unto itself. Even the most well-meaning and competent witch cannot possibly know the consequences of irrevocably manipulating it. So I'm to watch as my father's pain destroys him. It is not your pain to take. Every year, a student sees something sillier than I could ever imagine in their tea leaves. Oh, Miss Morgana, 
Welcome back to Hogwarts, Professor. That's going to take some getting used to. Mm. Professor Rickwood? I was so pleased to hear that you'd accepted the position of Defense Against the Dark Arts, Professor. Sit, sit, Isadora. Tell us about your travels. I was actually hoping that you and the others might join me at my home this evening. There's much I'd like to share with you. That would be delightful. We shall let the others know. Very well. I shall see you then. Hmm. Another memory. Now to find a way out of there. crystallized stone. That must be the way back to the map chamber. Alright. Let's go back to the map chamber and uh, see what you got next. What have we here? I'm a student at Hogwarts, sir, and this is Professor Fig. Professor Charles Rookwood at your service. Has someone completed the first trial? I have, Professor Rookwood. You look familiar, sir. I imagine you saw me in the first pensive you accessed, in Gringotts. So, you found the port key to access Professor Rackham's vault, and you deciphered the map within the locket you found floating above that pensive. I did. I found something that I can't identify floating above the last pensive. Ah, yes. You will find a similar artifact in each trial. You must take care to keep them safe. You will need them to complete the journey we have set forth for you. Once you have them all, we will tell you what to do with them. Very well. Are you able to tell me anything about the next trial? Before you proceed, I would like to speak with Charles regarding the urgent situation involving the goblins. The goblins? The student has seen traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. They and their mentor, Professor Fig, not only encountered goblins lurking outside of San Bacar's tower, they also encountered a powerful goblin in my vault at Gringotts. Hmm. I'm afraid it would be wise to halt the trials until we know more. We shall defer to you in this matter, of course. Now then... Wait, Professor. The name Rookwood. Do you think... That there's a connection to Victor? Perhaps. But we can't be sure of its significance, if any. For now... Tell me what you saw in the pensive. Before the witch from the last pensive, Isadora, became a Hogwarts professor, she argued with Professor Rackham about using magic to remove pain. Hmm. Hopefully the next pensive provides more context. For now, we should learn what Ramrock knows. I will be honest. I've no idea where to start. Actually, I might know of someone. I saw Serona at the Three Broomsticks speaking to a goblin once. They seemed friendly. Well, it's worth a try. See what you can find out. Of course, don't forget... My studies. Yes, sir. Uh, before you go... Professor? Have you encountered swirling traces of magic in the world? Uh, aside from those along our path? Not that I recall. What are they? Evidence of the Keeper's efforts to manipulate the power of ancient magic during our time. If I am correct, and I usually am, you should be able to use them to inform and enhance your own magic. Thank you, sir. I will look out for them. And now fall... In the game. Back in a car room where we sleep. Well, back in a room where we can't sleep. 
sleep in the no. Hello to everyone. But that is our main quest complete. I'm pretty sure we're gonna get an owl from Sebastian telling us that we gonna. I should ask Serona at the three broom. I've got spectacular news. The broom upgrade's ready. Ha, stop by the shop when you can. All right. I hope you will come and see me about a pressing and highly confidential matter at your earliest convenience. I believe that we may be able to help each other. Alright. We got three main quests here. I got Beast Class. The uh, clock is a lunar moon lament, and got the helmet of this one, which we need will need uh, the puzzle for and need to be level twelve. Uh, side quests we can do this one sweeping the commands. Uh, first is the Brimac Rays from all um, yeah. If we go to main, we get these three we could do in the next episode. Let's see, 13, 14, 12. We'll probably do this one first. Then we'll probably do this one, and then we'll probably do this one. Since we are leveled over for each of these. Now the only thing is, uh, this one, the Lunar Lament, this one, eh, not my funnest one to do, because this one we only got to do at night, but we'll do that one a bit later, I'll do anything in Dark Arts, again in Darren's Curse. <laughs> Um, a curse inflicts remains of enemies for a longer period of time, so we're gonna go ahead and grab that. Um, we do not have the knockback curse thing. Because we do need to complete a uh, pendo. Then we'll get this one. But dude, I cannot wait until we get, uh, the slowing curse one. But also, Crucio Mastery and Perio Mastery. And curse a uh, sapphire, and of course a Vodakadava mastery. One of my favorite curses in the entire game. No cap, man. Uh, the gloves. Yeah, dude, we can actually sell this stuff for a lot of money. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go and sell this stuff for money. Let's go to Hogsmeade. And it is one in Hogs. We do have one in Hogsmeade. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, teleport here. Sell this stuff. So we can get some more money and then we can actually you know purchase the stuff we need from Tom and Skulls. Please see me after class once you have completed the tasks I've set for you. I would like to teach you Descendo, useful for pulling objects to the ground. I didn't get to see I know you guys can't see my facial uh facial expression right now. But seriously, let me tell ya, I just put my hand on my face right now because... <laughs> we got another, we got another main quest to uh, take on here. So as you guys look here, um, right here, the, uh, the assignments, collect, uh, collect, uh, troll, Billions, uh, billions, 
and cast the full cell on the level to the enemy. Which is not too hard. Alright. Got distracted. Oh, what time I have to? Time of an hour. Alright, um. Let's sell this stuff and then, uh. I don't wanna. No, end off the episode because we got a lot to do in the next episode. Got that. I still didn't turn around and end this game and... Uh, yeah, sure, totally. Rebellion. So this... Ready for a little change in fashion, are we? Plenty to choose from here, so take your time. Got that. Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. Uh, let's see. This is their offense. This is their offense. Uh, we need the money. Honestly, their offense, not really that. Not really useful. Not really useful in terms of, uh, no combat. Offense, not really that useful. You know, good defense and good offense. Plus, I'm playing, playing the game on the easy difficulty. So, really, the stats don't really matter, technically. But, uh, yeah, we're pretty much done here. I'm just gonna go ahead and teleport to... Right... Here, go to Tome and Scrolls, and buy the stuff that we need for next episode. We will take on the side quest eventually, just not now. I'm so turned around, dude. I'm gonna lean the wrong way. I'm sure how I think it's gonna turn, turn around. It's always nice to see a familiar face. Alright, uh, what we want to do is we want to grab what we can afford. Yep. Nothing like finding just I don't the want right that. Uh, I think we're good. Let me know if there's anything else I can do to With the medium pot. I mean, did grab the, uh, the thing. Alright, so I think I might end off this episode. I think I might, not, I might end off this episode in the room of requirements. So I'm actually gonna go, uh, go in the hotel and uh, the hotel for there. Hogwarts. Room of Requirements. And just, uh, no, end it off here. So, uh, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Hogwarts Legacy. In the next episode, we will take on some of the side quests that we need to take on. Uh, we'll take on the side quests and the Hogs games first. 
and now we'll take on Beast Class and uh yeah we'll just progress the story of it until Sebastian hits us up again to I had to spellcraft with him and me and then like no we can continue on that storyline yeah you can continue on you can continue forward with the uh, in the shadow uh quest So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Have a great day. Peace out.